different look for me, but I really don't care right now. Um, just got done at the dentist. Uh, I do not have my bar anymore. It is gone for time being. Um, they were trying to fix my lower that clips in and it wouldn't fix. And because they tried to fix it, it wouldn't go back to what it was before, um, which was not their fault. Um, this was the lab's fault. Um, not my dentist lab, but a lab that they had sent it off to uh, in the previous month back in October, September, October. Um, and the lab guy who is the magazine, and I feel so bad for crying in front of him because I know it made him feel really bad, but uh, did everything he could to fix it. I mean, did everything he could. And he went above and beyond, spent hours with me to try to fix it, and it just, it wouldn't fix. So, um, now they are going to be remaking me a new one. Um, they are, um, going to send it off to a different lab um, and maybe even now he has kind of talked about maybe doing a screw in bottle which means it would not come out that would be a blessing in disguise uh, to have something that doesn't come out would be amazing uh, and I would absolutely love that and I pray that that's something that he can do and we end up going with that but if not then they will fix my bar and they will create me a new lower that snaps on that actually fits. Um, you know, this I think was bothering my implants. It was pushing on them. And um, so I knew something was up. Uh, so this, like I said, is a blessing in disguise, even though right now I feel absolutely just emotionally wrecked um, having to go back to my lower but my mouth feels great. Um, I don't have that big metal bar in it right now. But uh, yeah, I've been crying, I've been an emotional wreck. Um, this is about as raw as it gets. Um, you know, some days you're gonna have really, really bad days. Really, really bad days. But, it's you going through it and I wouldn't change it for the world because I think that people need to see this part because it's not all sunshines and rainbows you know as much as I would love it to be it's not um, and I don't regret it I don't regret doing this because it was made me really really sick and it needed to be done and it was important but sometimes it just plays on your emotions and your insecurities and your worries and your doubts. But I will say this. I have a great dentist. I have a great dentist staff. There's a hair in my eyeball. You know, I have an amazing team that is doing everything they can to fix it. So, all in all, I am extremely blessed. And while it may not feel it right now, and I may be upset, I will get through this because for one, God has my back. For two, I have the amazing dentist and staff. And for three, I'm a really strong person. Um, you know, I've been through so much in my life that this is just a speed bump. Um, but I just wanted to let you guys know, and I'm sorry for the mess and the way I look and crying, but it needed to be done and it needed to be shown that every day is not a good day. And sometimes you have really, really bad days and it's how you get through those bad days is what counts. So, all right guys, have a great Thursday. I am home to gonna go home and try to rest my gums they're really sore from him taking that um, bar out and uh, it's gonna live life for a while all right bye